I once spent the night lying on a platform above an animal watering hole, staring into the vastness of space while beholding the great, fathomless mystery of the African sky. Aaron, my youngest son, then three years old, lay curled up next to me like a kitten lost in its dreams. Dazzled by the inconceivable expanse of the sky whose darkness was so overcome with the light from billions of stars that lived in it that I lost myself in timelessness and infinity. That night, I'd come not to think or to wonder, but to know with absolute certainty in every cell and molecule of my body that this cosmic world was not something separate from myself nor I from it. We were, in a way I will never be able to understand rationally, we were one being. It was one of the greatest moments of my life. Like the proverbial iceberg, Most of us live with a lion's share of our potential for freedom and creativity and joy and authentic power submerged beneath a sea of unknowing. We go about our day-to-day duties and pleasures, conscious only of what comes to us through our five senses. How does it taste and feel? How, how, what does it sound like? Uh, what do we see in front of our eyes? Meanwhile, beneath the vast ocean of consciousness, that constitutes what it is to be fully human, our greater selves hibernate, waiting to be awakened. Sometimes, when we fall in love, perhaps, or when we're faced with an event of life-shattering proportions, like a critical illness or the death of a close friend, a submerged area of our being erupts in magic or horror, and often in surges of passion, energy, and beauty. Then, for a time, the mundane quality of everyday life is replaced with a sense of expanded being. Not only do we feel more alive, but we also wake up to find that familiar things, like the tree that stands outside a bedroom window or the cat that greets us when we come home each day, a simple shell we picked up and slipped into our pocket while walking on the beach. All of these things have taken on a luminosity that there's no way that we can explain. Other times, without warning, while listening to music or or walking down a city street, we're suddenly gripped with a sense that the world is far greater than, than, than we ever imagined it to be, and certainly that all we see around us somehow is us. And while the experience lasts, everything seems right in the world. Then, like the sun at the point of setting, everything fades beneath the mundane horizon, leaving only the faintest wisp of color to remind us that we once stood in its glory, felt its rays on our bodies, and knew that being at one with the universe brings a sense of meaning to our own lives and the lives of others that is simply indescribable. The greatest desire that I have is to live my life conscious of the oneness to which we all belong. The universe, reflected in that African sky and stretching out to infinity, this lives inside each one of us. And awakening to this reality floods our bodies and our lives with wonderment. It also opens us to infinite freedom at the very core of our being. What a blessing to behold.